established quarterback of Jeff Donovan and, and Matt accepted that role, competed every day to get better. And then when it was his turn, he, he really blossomed. Whenever I'm watching Matt, I always I always know that there's, there's a chance that we can score on that very play because he, he is that good of a player. Matt is the most competitive person I know. Darts to basketball to the football field and practice field, he's very competitive. He's a great leader, he's a great player. When Matt got hurt in our last game, last year against lacrosse, no one knew really how bad it was until a few days later. And by that time, he sucked it up and he knew what he had to do now for the team and he was still one of our biggest leaders. It was a growing experience, uh, extremely humbling. Uh, I always tell people that I've really grown as a person because of it. I think it's carried over to this season because he understands the significance of every game that he plays. And that was very tough and I don't know if uh, a young man, a, a competitive student athlete, uh, could have handled it any better than, than how Matt handled it. I think Matt, you know, is an outstanding student of the, of the game, and I think that's one of the qualities for me as the offensive coordinator that really sticks out. There's always fundamental skills to work on uh, as a quarterback. Really, I just always try to expand my knowledge of the game, watch a ton of film, uh, analyze defenses, you know, Focus on footwork, you know, arm strength, uh, getting stronger, getting faster, all the physical attributes. To be a good leader, you have to lead by example. And every workout, every practice that Matt is a part of, he's going 100%. I've never seen a harder working kid in my life. You know, Matt is the kind of kid that he's always the first one there and the last one to leave. You know, in the classroom, everything. He's just a great competitor. And then at the same time, he's, you know, one of your best friends. And I think that's why we've gotten to where we are, because of leaders like Matt. You know, I would always say, you know, oh, well, I'm a, I'm a top four finalist and everything like that. And I was like, ah, you know, maybe someday I'll get there, you know. And I was just hoping, uh, hoping our team would stay successful and, and hopefully uh, someday maybe uh, an opportunity like this would, would arise. He's led the way, and I really can't thank him enough uh, for everything he's done for me. Uh, and he and I just have the closest relationship in the world, and I'm, I'm truly blessed to have him in my life. We see that it's important that our students, indeed our students first and athletes second. And Matt Blanchard is an example of a student who has done well in the classroom, and he has also done exceptionally well on the athletic field. This is such a short legacy that we have here um, that you really want to make the most of your opportunities. Uh, and the fact that you know, I wanted to, to make sure I reached out to people uh, and make sure that you know, they don't really remember me as a, as a football player per se, but for the type of person that I was. As I watch him interact with so many people, including my own children, he's just everything that uh, you, you'd hope you'd want your student athletes to be. And, and someday I'd, I'd hope that my son would, would grow up to be, uh, to be like Matt Blanchard. And if, and if that, that would be the case, I think my wife and I would be awfully proud.